Good afternoon, oil traders. It is just after close here on the East Coast uh, in North America, where it's at uh, 4.05 p.m. It closed five minutes ago. And wouldn't you know it, the first day we finally make it back over $50, only to collapse um, to the lower 48s. Um, I was really, as you guys know, my target to exit uh, one or more short positions was $48. And I really thought that, you know, based on the action that we were getting today that we would see 48. Uh, unfortunately, the lowest we got was I think uh, 48.35 um, and then we bounced for 36 maybe. Uh, and then we bounced back up to where we are right now, the 48.48. 48. Uh, as you know, I've been really kind of frustrated with uh, having not gotten out of my 49 and a half short um, on the many opportunities that we've had over the past uh, week and a half, two weeks or so. Um, if I zoom out to the seven day um, trading here, you can see that we've volleyed back and forth between kind of upper 49s and uh, low, kind of upper 48s. Um, having that 49 and a half short, I could have sold that and repurchased it several times over. Um, and that frustration, I suppose, is what got to me and I decided to play it safe today and uh, take out uh, that 49 and a half, uh, specifically the 49.55 short. Um, I sold it at 48.45 with about 10 minutes left in trading. Um, it was a 4.44% profit or uh, $717. Uh, you can see that reflected on my tradingjournal.ca account right here. Uh, which uh, reduces my portfolio in the shorts. The HOD is the uh, e short ETF on oil, uh, D for down, U for up. Uh, so one less short position there. Uh, if I do a refresh on these prices here and refresh the page, that'll give us uh, a more uh, current view of things. Um, as you can see, I'm still very, very heavily uh, weighted on the bear side of things. Um, so obviously my expectation is that we're going uh, lower. And uh, an opening at or below 48 tomorrow wouldn't surprise me at all. But that being said, it also wouldn't surprise me if we went back to 50, which is why I decided to take that profit. Because if I got burned again with a rally following this uh, low close, I really would have been kicking myself. So I played it safe. Um, you know, four and a half, almost four and a half percent profit, over seven hundred dollar profit, is uh, nothing to sneeze at, and I should have done it sooner. But it is what it is, so I took it. And if we do rally, I'll repurchase that short again. And if we continue falling, then I have other shorts to sell, as well as a long position to add to my portfolio if we fall far enough. Um, so. That's that. Uh, I'd love to hear what you guys thought of today's action, um, falling, you know, almost what over a dollar at one point, two uh, percent. That's four percent on the ETFs uh, because they're a factor of two x, uh, which is how I got the four and a half, almost four and a half percent return. Uh, because, yeah. Anyway, that that is it. Uh, I'd love to hear how you guys played this or what your expectations are for Friday as we finish up this week. You can hit me up down below on YouTube in the comments or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, trades, charts, and results, of course. Until then, uh, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys tomorrow ahead of trading at 9.30 a.m. Eastern here on the East Coast. Until then, cheers.